Next one, we're going to dump a cup of water in each one. And you can add food color into this one right here, have them do the same thing, name different types of pollutions and stuff like that. So here I'm going to dump a cup of water in here. Make sure not to overfill it. All right. I will fill up the second one. And I will pour it in here. Like I said, make sure to go nice and slow, not to overfill it. All right. And now we basically want to sit here and let the water drain through and uh, basically have people guess which one's going to be cleaner and which one's going to be dirtier. As you can see, it filters into the bottom like that. All right. As we can tell here, the water's pretty much flowed through, still dripping out. Basically, you look at it, this one's still dirty. I didn't add food coloring to it, but food coloring will make it show a lot more, um, a lot more drastic. Like I said, the food coloring, coloring will represent pollution and stuff like that. This is the one with grass. It's pretty clean. Like I said, when this gets done, um, analyze it, let, let everybody look at it, let them come to a conclusion, and uh, basically discuss it. And also, too, for my other exhibit, here's the water for that. It's pretty much poured out now. Like I said, go through it, analyze it, and discuss the situations. Um, I have three gallons of water here to use. I also have sponges and stuff like that. The only thing I need to add are paper towels. And um, I would recommend doing these exhibits whenever you have downtime and if you want to, you know, bring people over. If you're busy, don't worry about doing it. But if you need, if you want to have some kids and show off and do stuff like that, it's a good time for it. I got to get out of here. Take care. Bye-bye.